welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Uh, viewer request. Somebody wanted me to do more WTA rackets. Um, the only other one from the women's tour that I have is uh, Jeannie Bouchard's uh, currently. So here is Jeannie Bouchard's. This is an older racket. She has since moved on to Yonix. So she's using the V-Core 100 from what I've read. Uh, so, but I do have this. This was a match use racket from Bouchard's bag. And it is a pink AeroPro Drive Plus. And there's a little, little circle thing in there. It says 49 pounds. And it, right above it, it's four and a quarter. So it's got Babolat RPM 17 gauge strings. Two piece stringing on there. Let's measure to see if it's half inch longer. It is 27 and a half. So it is longer. All right. Grip size feels like a quarter with an over grip on it. Double check that one. Quarters there. Yeah. Yep, that's it. Quarter with an overgrip on it. All right. This feels pretty stock to me. I don't think that there's too much customization in this thing. Open up the trap door. Oh, wait, look. There is silicone down there. Hmm, interesting. And I will show you guys how to do this in a future video. I just, I have to go to the hardware store um, cause I'm out of stuff to do. And good thing the hardware store is open. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I have a Arrow Drive Plus standard here, and I'm gonna compare these two. Uh, this is a half though, so there might be a slight uh, difference in here. I'm gonna actually open this up. See if it started hollow. Yeah, see, so it's hollow, single chamber. All right, let's hit the scale. Look at the cute way she signed it though. Genie, all right? That's cute. All right, add the scale. Hers weighs, it's it's pretty balanced. The only, that's the only way I can describe it is that it's pretty balanced. I don't think there's any lead in the head, but let's see where, uh, where we come out at. 323.5. Standard one is 321.5. So not much of a difference at all. Let's check the swing weight of it. Three twenty-four on the swing weight of Bouchard's stock one. This might be slightly off because again, this is a half. So three twenty-eight. A little more swing weight here. A little more head weight. It's probably the silicone throwing it off. A bit. All right, let's see. Let's look at the shards balance here. So it's right at three 
32.6, let's say, 32.6. So 326 on the balance. Again, this is gonna be off a bit because that's a half. So let's see where we lay. This is gonna be at right 333 on the dot here. So 333 millimeters. So just a little secret for you guys. When I first got this racket, I saw that she signed it up top. So I took it out and I played with it because I was able to hold it down here and, and swing it. Um, the thing that I felt with this racket was that it was pretty evenly balanced and it cut through the air pretty smoothly. Um, maybe because it was psychological that, you know, this came from a, a pro. Um, so, uh, I don't know, but I, I had to use it just cause I, you know, had the chance. It played well though. It did play well. Now, uh, to sum it up, I mean, you guys know a lot about this, but from what I can see from those measurements, aside from that silicone being in this handle and throwing the weight off a bit, uh, that's probably the only difference from um, her racket to a stock version of her racket. But you guys probably know better than I do. Um, but it, this to me looks like a stock racket. Um, probably maybe with a higher quality standards is, is what I'm imagining. All right. So that's Jeannie Bouchard's racket. Thanks for watching Tennis Spin where we put our spin on your tennis.